Look how weird <laughs> these people are lining up in a single file line for the queue line. They're doing this because they don't have a group or anybody in their group uh, in the park. But it's just, it looks so weird. It looks like they're freaking robots. <laughs> anyway, uh, we have a roller coaster to finish. That coaster is this one. It's a corkscrew coaster. And uh, so far, I don't know how this ride is going. Um, probably not well. How fast is it going up that chain hill? I think it is going up as fast as possible. Can we make it faster? Also, I can't hear anything. Let's see. Yeah, that's as fast as possible. Okay. Uh, we were about right here. I don't think I'm a fan of how it's turning out. Um, there's not enough Cobra Rolls. You know, every corkscrew coaster is known for its Cobra Rolls. We have one corkscrew. <laughs> uh, maybe I can get a Cobra Roll. No, this is going to be a hill, isn't it? Yeah, we need a hill. And you know what? I don't know how much speed's gonna have through here. But let's go this way with it. Cause why not? That's probably gonna be a little crazy. Where is this ride right now? Okay, it's over there. Seeing some good numbers. Seven. Goes around. We gotta watch fear. I think that's the biggest issue right there. Fear. We hit 11, but that was a 6 fear. But that was 11 excitement. 9, 10. Okay, it's going well. Let us do this. Oh, the end is right there. Okay. And then we're gonna go. Can we do another? Ooh, let's try it. Rolls. Corkscrew. No, 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 no. We want to go. We want a straight piece of track. Rolls. Corkscrew. Actually, back that up. Because it's, it's kind of weird right now. It's doing that thing. There we go. I feel like they changed something here when it, came, when it comes to adding these loops with the track. And they made it better. Which, honestly, is mind-blowing. Because I never thought I'd ever say that about this game. <laughs> Something is actually working better than it used to. And maybe it's just me, but I feel like it is. Okay, let's see what it's going to look like through here. It's probably going to be way too intense. But, uh, that's so why I'm not going to keep on building. I'm going to wait to see what's going to happen. 12? Oh my god. I just hit a freaking 12. And yeah, the numbers afterwards were way too intense, so we can't do any of it. I, that was a 12! A freaking 12! Let's edit this piece of track. I want... No, I want to edit this piece of track right here. The one that I'm clicking. Okay, apparently I'm editing this entire section. I want to increase the bank. Increase the, the bank. Banking the opposite way. See that? See which way the track's going and look which way I have to move my mouse? Okay, it's fine. Oh, we're in the ground now. Cool. Not what I wanted. That's as big as I can make that piece of track? Yes. Okay, let's see if we can smooth the banking here, just so you know it's all... as good as possible. I guess we'll throw a hill in then, because... Right, you know what we probably should do? We should make this turn wider. Oh my god. Yeah, we need to make the turn wider. Also, no, we need a bank more here. Because apparently the bank is... <gasps> See, I complimented the game on one thing and now this is happening. Lesson learned. Never compliment the game. It doesn't deserve it. Okay. Straight away. Bring that back in like this. Let's try to get a hill. Like that. Now we have to wait for the freaking train to get back here. Times three speed. That should do it. Okay. God, we do the fear skyrockets. And I don't know why. It's almost like it's pretty intense. What? How? I don't know, it doesn't seem like it's going that fast. Maybe I should actually look at the speed instead of just, you know, assuming it's not going that fast. 
I thought this coaster was going to be awful, and yeah, it might be weird to ride, but stats-wise, it might end up being alright. 60 miles an hour. Okay, that makes a little more sense. <laughs> we need a wider hill, or a bigger hill. I just don't want to smack into the bottom of here. Angle snap off. I'm pretty sure we're making this coaster do things it has no reason to do. Can I throw another hill in here? Wait! Corkscrew! <laughs> yes! Um, how do I want to do this? I guess we should probably go under first. The battery banked enough. I mean, it's only going like 60 miles an hour through there. It should be fine. It's not going to be fine. We're going to need to throw brakes and I have a feeling. Uh, back that. It's another 11. Oh my god. Alright. We... <laughs> It's like we have good excitement, but also the fear is too much. But the excitement is so good, but the fear. What if we, uh, what if we make this not as hill like? We lift this. I kind of don't want to smooth all because that's going to make my turn less wide, and we need a wider turn here. In fact, I should probably make this turn a little bit wider. It's at 90 freaking degrees. Okay, there we go. So let us do that, and then can we get one more freaking thing in? No, nope, it needs to be a little bit longer of a track. Rolls. That's not gonna work, is it? Nope, it almost works. It's almost there. Maybe next time. Ooh, but this could work. Hold on. Okay, it's working. And we're right near the exit, or the end of the ride, so that's kind of cool. Are these brake tracks, or what are these? I have no idea. Are they just drive tires? Are they... No, they're definitely not drive tires because it's on a slope, right? So they have to be a block section, okay. Yeah, it's a block section. The tires, the those are brakes in the middle of the tires, push it along. Okay, that's a block section. If it was just the brakes, the, there wouldn't be tires. Okay. So I guess now we have to roll this way, or bank this way. And I somehow have to... Thank you, autocomplete. You're absolutely worthless. <laughs> so bad. It's so bad. Autocomplete is just absolute garbage. There, I said it. I didn't want to say it, but I said it. I kind of hate this, what I'm doing here. But we need to bring her back to the station. I guess we can, uh, there we go. Yeah, we could throw trim brakes before this. I don't feel like it's going that fast, but apparently it is. Okay. It's a good target speed. 24? Sure. Let's go with 24. Let's see what happens here. The coaster's done. <laughs> what a mess. What an absolute mess. I love it. Much better. We can probably make that a little bit faster. I wish I saw the target speed. Okay, times three speed. With two trains going, it's a 6.17. With one train, it was like 6.48. Not as high as I thought it was going to be. Kind of a bit bummed about that.
It's fine. It's a good people. It's now 6.6. .6. Okay, whatever. Don't care. It's done. We did it, everyone. The ride's done. The coaster's done. It's a great coaster. Coaster name. It needs a name, by the way. So leave your name suggestions down below. I hope that this is the exit. Okay, good it is. Um, we need to... Let's do this. Paths. This is the path we're using, right? I think it is. We'll go this way with it. Directly underneath the path. Path. Coaster. Easy. For the queue line. What was I doing for the queue line? Was it this one? I think it was this one. Boy, I sure do love not using priority passes. God, they definitely are for suckers, you know? I mean, the game was telling me that all along, and I didn't believe the game. And I didn't believe the game. I should have listened to the game. Priority passes are for suckers. Just don't bother putting them on any of your rides, because they're not worth it. Look how much better my queue lines look now that I'm not using priority passes. So much better. I don't even care that this is so long. Perfect. It's the best queue line ever. The ride is open. So we're probably going to need garbage cans down here and benches and all that fun stuff. We also should probably ride the ride. Hold on. The ride's not open. I, I was lying because I'm a liar. I lie. We're riding the ride first. <laughs> here we go. The corkscrew coaster. Definitely needs more uh, cobra rolls. But uh, the next one. The next one will be nothing but cobra rolls. <laughs> It'll be a giga coaster. <laughs> giga coaster with nothing but cobra rolls. Yes. They do exist. That's how most giga coasters are. They pretty much just have cobra rolls. Through King Donut. I think the next coaster we're going to make is going to be one that doesn't instantly go through King Donut. That's the challenge. Okay, ignore this. It's disgusting. It does even feel like we're going that fast to do some of the stuff we're doing. Yet here we are. I just don't think this coaster was meant to go this fast. I might be wrong, but judging by the noises it's making... <laughs> it's making an awful lot of rattling and clicking noises that sounds like it's saying, Hey, going a little too fast here, bud. And there you have it. The corkscrew coaster. I need to change the colors, too. Um, as I was saying, what was I saying? What the hell was I saying? I was saying something, wasn't I? Probably was. What was I saying? I have no idea. Um, <laughs> we were talking about the path. The, the ride and the ride. I came over here. Garbage cans. I have no idea. I was going to say something and I don't know what it was yet. We need garbage cans down here, though, so let's do that. Right! I was talking about... <laughs> Building a coaster and not having it instantly go through King Donut. That's what I was talking about. Right, okay, we're here now. Um, yeah, this coaster, Chain Hill, through King Donut. This coaster, Chain Hill, drop down through King Donut. This coaster, launch, right away, through King Donut. I want to have a coaster that does some stuff, then goes through King Donut, then continues. I want, them, I want it around mid-run, instead of, like, right at the beginning. So that is the challenge now. Whew. We got there, everyone. We got there. Garbage can right in front of the queue line. Why? Because people walk towards the queue lines. And, uh... They have no choice but to throw their garbage out there. Sure, we'll pull in there. How much staff do we have? Do we need more? Probably. Obstru oh, crap! That's the edge of the park! Whoops! <laughs> I even I thought the edge of the park was like out here. No, it's right there. Okay, that's fine. It's perfectly fine. That's it's great. It's exactly what I wanted. <laughs> Let us get some garbage cans. Like that person's holding garbage. Should we wait to see if she drops it on the ground? Go ahead, do it. Do it. We're just gonna follow her. She's super thirsty and has to use the bathroom. Oh. <gasps> 
I just witnessed it. What'd she say? What did she say? Hold on a second. Yeah, you've been caught, Sandra Latham. She didn't even say anything. She just dropped it on the ground without a care in the world. You're gone, Sandra. You're gone. I caught you polluting in my park. You're a litterer. Get out. Get busted, idiot. Go ahead. Go ahead. Wow, that guard is flying by. Yeah, he saw you throw garbage on the ground. What are your thoughts, idiot? I can't believe they asked me to leave. I've never broken a law in my life. This isn't the end. No, you did break a law. You threw your crap on the ground. Are you kidding me? Are, out of all the dumb thoughts that the guests have in this game, because for some reason the people who program them are actually robots and don't know how people think, they think they can get away with that? What? Anyway. <laughs> Let's uh, change the color of the wooden coaster. Why? Because it kind of sticks. It's, it's weird. It doesn't fit. You know, we're going with chocolatey don't chocolate donut. We're going with donuts. So it's a wooden coaster. Wooden coasters are made out of wood. Wood is brown. Donuts can be brown. Let's make this coaster look more appetizing is what I'm getting at. <laughs> Should we make it look like a like glazed donut? Or like a dark chocolate donut? Or just a chocolate donut and not dark chocolate. Just a chocolate donut. We could do that. Because right now it just looks like weathered wood. Which is gross. The supports are apparently orange. Something's orange on this ride. Or maybe it's the cars. <laughs> no, the car colors are right there. I have no idea what's orange on this thing. Um, track color. Give me that color wheel. Okay, that's better. I don't think we're gonna make it look as good as it could be just because it looks like weathered wood and there's nothing we can do about that. I don't even know what this is changing. Probably this is the supports. Um, this is probably something. And then I don't know what this is, but... I mean, sure, it could stay the same color. It looks like glazed. Okay. Hey. Car color. It looks so orange, yet it's so dark. Let's make that look... Like gla I <laughs> glazed... Glazed donut. It's a glazed donut coaster. There we go. Um, good. Maybe we can make it more of a... There. There. This is good. Glazed donut. It'll make you go nuts. <laughs> good enough. It definitely looks better than the other colors it had. Okay, and now this coaster. This is... Okay. It, the coaster's bright red, and it's going through a gingerbread station. So... Let's change this one, too. What colors am I going to make it? I don't know. Let's go with a jelly-filled donut. Why? Why not? Powdered sugar on the outside. And then the coaster itself will be... Oh, these aren't actually colors. Whoops. My bad. Oh, we got to get rid of those supports, too. Eh. Nah, it's fine. I think I have, I have to close the ride to get rid of those supports, so screw that. I'm not doing that. And it's too... I guess that'll work. That No, 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 that's not going to work. The support color needs to change. There we go. It's it's a powdered sugar. Powdered sugar. And it does look kind of powdery sugar. Good. And then the cars. The cars are white. No. The cars need to be... jam colored. Should we go strawberry? Let's go strawberry. So, yeah, they're going to be kind of reddish. I guess. Um, the blue needs to go. Well, maybe we can make that white. Or a light pinkish. There. There. Good. I'm having too much fun with this. Okay. There you go. This is a jelly, jelly filled donut coaster right there. Um, needs a name. Remember that. It needs a name. Real quick, let's look at the scenery we got, because we're already at 21 minutes old. How did that happen? How did we get this far into the... Jeez, time sure flies when you're making your coasters look like donuts and kicking people out of the park. Um, we have some scenery stuff. I saw one that I want to put in right away. It was a sword. 
There it is. King Donut Sword, made by Steel Vengeance. The King's Sword. Since King Donut is obviously, by first look, a mighty man, he deserves a sword. Sword. Okay, yeah, that's just a typo. He does actually know how to spell sword. <laughs> With kosher track for his mighty highness. Here we go. It's going in the other hand. Scepter in one hand, sword in the other. Oh my god, he looks glorious. <laughs> it's so good. Ooh, this is a ride. This ride looks really great. There's a lot of scenery involved. However, if you can look at the screen right now, you'll see there's a clump of trees. And I can't do anything with it. Because of the trees, I think. I don't know, it's weird because this does fit in my park. Like, if we push this all the way to the corner, um, right there, so that's still definitely in the park. These trees are 100% in the park. Like, yeah, they're in the roller coaster right now, but okay, look, we can even move it out a little bit. So now they're not in the coaster, they're floating. This thing is definitely in the park, but for some reason, it says obstructed, and I do not know why. I have no idea. So unless there's another tree somewhere that I can't see attached to this ride somewhere, I cannot put this ride in my park because of obstructed. Oh, this is, oh my, look at this, it's the start of a log flume. I'm assuming that has to go through King Donut. Oh my, there's, see, so much work went into this, all those, oh my god, it's a lot of, we would have to limit the number of uh, cars on this because uh, that's a very short, short shooting ride. And uh, people will be stuck in here forever. But yeah, there's trees attached, so I can't put that in anyway. So whoever put that in, or whoever submitted that, um, it won't work. Extreme. It's $180,000 ride. Look at this building. This is a great looking building. <laughs> and he has pip shot water out of business, closed. Get out. <laughs> Gone forever. <laughs> this is so good. Who made this? King Donut 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 25. That's all the things I said to add to the thing. This extremely good staff building contains a King, King's Club staff center that increases your guest happiness for your vendors, your entertainers. There's also, and then apparently I can't see the rest of the description, which I bet you whoever made this had their name at the end of that. So whoever made this, I'm sorry. This game sucks. And you can't actually see your name because for some reason it doesn't include the full description. Which is dumb. Um, we're putting this thing over here, I think. Right behind the king himself. He guards his club, which will never get used because we don't have staff features enabled. So, there's that. It's the forbidden club that no one has entry to. It's even, it's even more secretive now, so that makes it better. I'm trying to get that knight, there we go, to be in the ground. Okay. Oh, it looks like he's actually playing the horn. <laughs> That's amazing. Oh my, this building's so good. This is great. And it looks like there's an actual pip shot here, but in actuality, it's just, oh man. That's great. I don't know how they're gonna use the, um, the things here. Like, will the doors open? I want to sit here and watch it, but... I have other things I need to do. Frogaloo is the name. They named the bathroom Frogaloo. King Donuts Club. And the first aid is King Donut Healthcare. <laughs> it's so good. I love it. All right, real quick before ending this episode, because I think it's long enough. I don't actually know, because I got distracted, and I've been apparently recording for 31 minutes, but stuff is going to get edited out, so we'll see. Let's just look at the stations, the pre-made ones we have, and then see which one you guys, you know what, you guys tell me which one I should start with, or that I should start next episode building, because that's how we're going to start next episode, with a brand new coaster. We have Donut Airport Wing Coaster, Toadlet International Airport, ride name here, prepare to fly. It looks pretty cool. This one was made by Energy7373. We have the Donut Box, of course. I think this is the, this isn't the Giga. Oh, it is the Giga. Yeah, it's the Giga. Made by Energy7373. We have, is this the broken one? 
Okay, yeah, this one was re-uploaded, which is now this one. Yeah, the re-uploaded one. So this, it works now, is the, um... It's the single rail coaster. King Donuts Castle made by Camem, new and improved. <laughs> With less trees and rocks. Um, we have the dueling coaster, which I don't know if I'm ever going to use because I'm too stupid to figure it out. Well, I know how it works, but... I did it real quick and I couldn't get it set up right. It didn't work correctly. So, and again, trying to do something like this in this park is going to be a challenge. Um, we have a spinning coaster. So we can add that one. And that's it so far because we did just add this one. So pick one of those track rides. I think we also have a go-kart one. Yes, a go-kart station, which... <laughs> Looks pretty great. For a long time, I was wondering, like, you know, why on earth would they not attach the wheels to the cars? The, those cars don't actually have wheels. And then I now know why. It was so you could put donut wheels on it. And I'm really glad they did it that way. But yeah, there you go. Coaster needs a name. Pick which coaster I should build next episode. And that's where we're at. Anyway, thank you all for watching. Leave a like and share the video if you enjoyed. They helped a lot. Subscribe if you want to see more. And I'll see you next time.